Hey guys, I was just working on the Dragon Age Keep thing for the new Dragon Age Inquisition LP that I'll be doing pretty soon. And I just wanted to make a video going over to some of the choices. Um, I tried to get as many of the choices right as possible, but you know, it's been a while. I'm not sure that I got everything right, but I figured I would just make a short little video. Maybe, maybe it won't be so short, I don't know. There's a lot of choices to go over, but I thought I would show it off so that you guys can correct me if you guys remember anything. If you guys don't remember, then, you know, whatever. We'll just go with what my memory has provided. Um, I did go back and look at some videos to double check on some facts, but obviously I was not able to, like, track down every single one of these choices because... That's a lot of videos to go over. So anyways, Dragon Age Origins, we have Sorsha who died killing the Archdemon. Uh, companion, Sorsha did not have a romance uh, partnered thing. Uh, persuaded mother, the Reverend Mother to free Sten, recruited Sten, recruited Ogryn. Logan was executed, recruited Dog. I did not return Sten's sword. I don't remember anything about Sten's sword. Recruited Zevran. Zevran died because I killed him. Alster became king. They were, yeah, Warden and Alistair were not lovers. Recruited Win. Win's alive. Lillian is alive. Acquired Grimoire by uh, killing Flemeth, and Morgan did not have a baby. Uh, prologue. Ostagar, prisoner left alone. I think I just left him. I don't think I did anything to him. And I definitely cured the Mabari Hound. Um, at least I think I did. Did I? I hope I did. <laughs> uh, I think... I don't think I poisoned the urn. Urn is not poisoned, question mark. Arl of Redcliffe. Helped Redcliffe fight. Helped Redcliffe prepare. Freed Bevan. Did not find the sword. Helped Owen's daughter escape. Connor is alive but not possessed. Is old. Sacrificed herself and is dead. Bella took tavern ownership. Now this one I'm not 100% sure about, but whatever. I think it's right. I don't know. Nature of the beasts. I sided with the werewolves. Brought Kamen and Gain uh, together. Uh, told... Uh, I, I'm not sure about this one. Did I tell Athrith about his wife? I don't know. Uh, brought Varathorn Ironbark. I think I did. Um, returned Dagon to the Dalish camp. I think I did that, and I know for sure I did not help Elora with the Hala. Paragon of her kind, I defeated Bronca. Balin rules Orzammar. I left, or I sent Dagna off to study magic. I don't know who Marty is, but I'm guessing I didn't encounter them. And I obviously did not have a son with Marty because I was a woman. I think I... I don't think I killed Ruck. The, some of the options for this is to actually kill Ruck and tell the truth, or kill Ruck and say he died heroically. I think I respected Ruck's wishes to not tell his mother what was going on. I'm not sure about that, but I think I just told her that he died and left Ruck alive. Proved Legion of Dead connected to Noble House. Now that one I'm really not sure about. Did I do that? If you guys know, please tell me. Uh, wait, what is this? Stolen Town. Oh, I missed this one. I think I returned the tome to the Shaper. I'm not 100% sure. Um, I think I helped create the Chantry. This one, I have no idea. I, I chose Reconcile with Family because I have, like, some faint, faint memory of something like this happening, but that might have been from my first playthrough. I'm not sure. I have no idea what I did with this. Um, Rogek's Lyrium deal. I don't know what that's about, so I just didn't complete it. Orta. I definitely did help Orta, because I remember finding her stuff. Broken Circle... Supported the mages. Irving survived, I think. Right? Yeah, I'm, pr I'm pretty sure he survived. And I did not agree to Colin's request. Uh, 
Denarim. Sir Landry killed, I believe, in that one-on-one -on -one duel thing. Told Ben Sigurd about Oswin, the dude who was being tortured in the dungeons. I think I did that. Brought scroll to Sister Justine. I'm not sure that I did that. I don't know what this is about. Slim Goldry's crime rate wave. But I have a feeling Sorsha didn't do that. Help clear our customers out of Pearl? I'm not sure. Handled the Crimson Wars? I'm not really sure. Um, Sergeant Kylon. I think I did do this, yes. Uh, let's see. This? I'm not sure. Halfstana, her brother Emmerich's ring. This one also, not sure. But I'm just going to say that I did. Uh-huh. Um, Master Ignacio's assassinations. I don't, I don't think I did that. I don't think I encountered Goldana. That's Alistair's sister, or half sister. I even like looked this up on the wiki and tried to look at it, but I just I don't remember doing anything to do like with Goldana at all. And Marjolin, I I know Marjolin from. Liliana's song, but I don't remember encountering her in Origins. Maybe I did, but I just don't remember. So it's going to be did not encounter Marjolin. The lands meet, um, Alistair rules. Battle of Dunarim, Warden killed the Archdemon. Awakening expansion. Warden killed the architect. Keep was protected, not Amaranthine. Algren and Felsi reunited. I think I did that. I'm not sure. Or because the other option is Algren and Felsi parted on bad terms. I'm really not sure. I know I helped him somehow. I did something to do with this. I just don't know what the results were. Now this uh what? No, Nathaniel's alive. Oh! Is that why- I was about to put this in the video, because this was being really weird. Did ha da Okay, hold on. I'll make the change for now, but... I'll have to review that again. Witch Hunt did not go through the Alluvion. Warden's Keep gained a power of blood, slayed Sophia, and allowed Avernus ethical research. Storm Prisoner, Shale is alive, Matthias and Amalia both alive, neither possessed, and Shale was recruited. And on to Dragon Age 2. Even though I just did this, I actually remember it too well. <laughs> Hero, Talisa, she was mostly diplomatic, I think. Let's see, companions, no one romance, Bethany became a circle mage, Carver died, Bethany did not die in the final battle, recruited Isabella, Isabella returned to me, friends with Varric, Bartrand killed, helped Varric discover the cause of the haunting, Varric did not keep the red lir or lyrium idol, Fenris is dead, um, I did not hand over Isabella, didn't approve of Ender's actions at the Chantry, but Ender, Ender's is alive and well. Meryl stayed with Hawk. Meryl's alive and well. Meryl did not destroy the Alluvion. Aveline married Donic. Aveline stayed with Hawk. Meryl's clan was killed. Recruited Sebastian. Now, this one I was kind of like, eh, about? I don't know what constitutes making Talus angry. Because I don't, I didn't, I don't think I saw that option. I mean, I kind of like, got cranky on her at the end and was like, give me your scroll, blah, and she was like, uh, no, what you can have instead is the heart of many jewel. So, and then she left saying something like, um, take care, Hawk, maybe I'll see you again, blah. So I'm saying I didn't make Talos angry because I, I think there was the option to fight her and that was what would make her angry. So I don't think I made her angry and I did not kiss Talos.
And for prologue, I think I joined the smugglers, not the mercenaries. Uh, let's see. Act 1. Fought against the Templars. Returned Seamus to the Viscount. Guinness died, I think. Returned Cargo to Martin. I'm not sure about that, but I don't think it's really that important. Kelder killed. I'm not actually sure who Kelder is. Danzig, I did kill. I th think I did tell Gislin the truth. Uh, solve the mystery of the missing miners, question mark. I definitely don't think I blackmailed their... Yeah, sir. Sir Thrask. Iduna. I'm not sure who Iduna was, but I think I killed her. <laughs> I sent Fenriel to the Dalish. Karen was reinstated with the Templars for sure. I defended Katojan. And Karis? Alright, Karis was the one that I fought outside that wounded coast cave. I remember him. Uh, Legacy DLC. Which I sided with Larius, found Malcolm's will, I believe. I don't think I killed Gascard. Because... Yeah, he was that mage. I don't think I killed him, because I thought he was innocent. Um, this one I'm not really sure. I don't remember Varnell. Who is Varnell? I don't believe I would have done that. I definitely didn't side with Patrice. Discover looters of Hubert's caravans. I think I did that. Now this is what I was getting confused about. I definitely encountered Yevin, and I definitely saved Marin. I even have the video proof to Hey you. Oh, there's two of your boys. So I Yevin, won. and then he's he says, I not with he's you. not with you. I had hoped. And then there's Marin there in the background. Father. And I know he's Marin I because she His says betrayal he isn't lost. Marin and blah, and you're still sad that he didn't come, blah blah blah. So yes, I definitely saved Marin. But then when I choose this, it says that Nathaniel had to have died. And I'm pretty sure Nathaniel didn't die. And the weird thing is, I think this is in Act 3. I just played Act 3. It is very fresh in my mind. I definitely did not encounter Nathaniel. See, Delia Howe approached Hawk in Hightown, asking the champion to search for her brother Nathaniel, who didn't return from a deep road ex expedition with some fellow wardens. This is Act 3. I just played Act 3. I... I did not encounter Nathaniel, but it keeps saying that if I saved Marin, then Nathaniel has to be dead. So I don't get it. I guess I'm going to keep it as did not encounter Yevon, even though I definitely did, because I definitely left Nathaniel alive in Origins. And I definitely did not encounter him in Act 3. <laughs> uh, Javaris, the dude with the gunpowder thing. I don't remember if I killed him or not. I'm gonna say he's alive. Uh, Lieutenant Harley with the raiders on the cliffs? Question mark. Did I do this? I doesn't ring a bell, so I said I didn't encounter him. I definitely killed Arishok. And Fainreal... Oh, I don't think I... I think I missed this. You ran away from the alienage. I think... I think he is freed in Left for Deventer? I'm not sure. Okay. Now on to Act 3. I don't know who Nuncio is, so I don't think Nuncio sought me out. Did not find Zevran, because I definitely would remember that. I think what I did with the conspirators is hand him over to Meredith. I know I was like working with Orsino, but I, I think I like un 
willingly kind of handed them over to Meredith. Did not encounter Nathaniel, for sure. I did not help Uncle Gamlin. Apparently there's some quest to, like, reunite him with something or other. I don't know. Now, looking at this, I was feeling at the end of Dragon Age 2, like, wow, Act 3 was really freaking short. And yeah, it is shorter than the other acts, but maybe it was shorter than it already was because I missed out on a bunch of shit. Like, the Nuncio and Zevran thing, the Nathaniel thing, Gamlin, question mark, I don't know, I didn't encounter any of this stuff. Uh, returned to meal to the circle, sided with the mages, I let Kieran go, and I killed the dragon at the bone pit. And I think that's it. Funny how the other two DLCs don't matter, apparently. <laughs> Mark of the Assassin? Well, I guess it kind of matters. Talus is in there. Anyways, those are the choices that I have chosen to import into Dragon Age Inquisition. If you guys know that I did something differently, then please tell me. Please let me know, because I won't be starting Inquisition for a couple of days at least. So, yeah, you guys have a little bit of time to let me know. I mean, I don't expect you guys to go trawling through all my videos to find the correct answers, but if you happen to remember what happened, then I would be grateful for your help in rectifying any mistakes in here. Anyways, thank you for watching, and thank you for any help, if you guys do help. See you guys in Dragon Age Inquisition.